we'll begin with the location of your battery switches, your electric panel, and then how to properly connect to shore power and switch to generator. First, with the location of your house bank battery switch, it's located here under this settee. We'll make sure that your house bank is in the on position. And you'll also find that your lifting platform power switches here and other breakers, which we'll go over in later in the video. Next, we're gonna go over the start bank battery switches. First, located in your master cabin. This one's gonna be here in your hanging locker at the bottom. We'll make sure that's in the on position. Next, your port engine battery switch is located in the port aft cabin here in the hanging locker. We'll also make sure that this is in the on position. Finally, the generator battery switch is located here under your nav station. You'll see the label, generator ba battery switch. And we'll make sure this is also in the on position. Now we're gonna go over proper shore power and how to connect to shore power at the docks. First thing we're gonna check is to make sure that your shore power breaker is in the off position. Your main panel is located here in the salon by the stairs to the master cabin. And we're just gonna make sure that your shore power is in the off position. Here at the dock, make sure that the shore pedestal is in the off position before you plug it in. Once you're certain that it's off, we're gonna plug in your shore cord and then turn it on. Now we can go back in the vessel and turn on shore power at, at the electric panel. Finally, back here at the electric panel, we're gonna make sure that you have shore power at the green indicator light and we'll turn it back on. Make sure that everything on your AC load is off before you turn this on. And that's it. Leopard catamarans are equipped with Northern Lights generator. On this particular vessel, it's located in your port forward locker on your bow. Now we're gonna go over how to properly switch to generator power. Remember, go over your owner's manual for proper operations and maintenance schedule. So first we're gonna start here. Make sure that your shore power and all your AC load is in the off position. So we're gonna make sure that everything is in off before we start the generator. Next, we'll warm up the generator, pressing the preheat switch for a few seconds. Then we'll turn over with the start, hold it for two to three seconds to let it build up oil pressure. Now that your generator is running, you can switch to generator power by turning on your generator switch at the electric panel. And that's it. Always remember, this is only an overview of your vessel's equipment and the best way to get to know your vessel is to review the owner's manual. Thank you.